What brings you out here? Girl. Murder. Are you trapped in this house? Can you touch her on the knee? Small town in Are you happy with the people that are living in this house right now? So? Yes. So if there is any lighthearted spirits that are here to communicate, we welcome you to a conversation with the devices in front of us. Malevolent spirits, evil spirits, are not welcome to this conversation and we really don't want them in this house, but lighthearted spirits are welcome. Is there any spirits here who would like to communicate? If there are any spirits in here, can you tell us your name? The homeowner said that he had his leg pulled while he was sleeping. Was that you? I swear to God, it's getting heavier. Like, mm -hmm. every time I ask a question. Is the spirits here a good spirit? Okay, we're gonna stop the EVP. Yep. And we're gonna check it. <sighs> we are recording Carolyn and Sean in the living room at Aaron's house. So if there is any lighthearted spirits that are here to communicate, we welcome you to a conversation with the devices in front of us. Malevolent spirits, evil spirits, are not welcome to this conversation and we really don't want them in this house. Yeah, because it's hard to hear spirits from all of you. Yeah, it's really soft. Well, there's there. some devices on the table. One of them you can light up. Careful. One of them you can speak okay. into. Is there any spirits here who would like to communicate? I'm holding a device that can actually hear you. And we have a device on the table that you can light up the lights for us. We highly encourage you trying these. We'd like to have a conversation with anyone here. We're open. As long as you're a good, kind-hearted entity or spirits, come in and join us. We're just looking to get a couple of answers. If you, we could ask you a couple of questions. Okay, we're gonna stop the EVP. Yep. And we're gonna check. Yeah. I'm wondering if, if there is anything on that for replies. If we just can't hear it because it's so damn soft. Right. I mean, then it's reviewed again with actual headphones, then maybe something will come up. But I don't know. Well. You could always try upstairs at the kitchen. Mm -hmm. Well, since he said that he, uh, I know we can't go into that room, but uh, there was activity upstairs. Maybe we should try in the living room upstairs. Mm -hmm. We could try to take maybe one of the necropods up or something and... Yeah. Yeah. Is there anybody here who would like to communicate? Can we get your name? Does anybody know the name 
a hydra wood. Is there anybody here by the name of Dorothy Wheeler? Dorothy, if you're here, do you see the little green light on the t on the table? There's a little green light right in front of me. You can make that light up. If you want to play shy, there's a device out by the window in the hallway. It has a little antenna on it. If you touch the antenna, it plays like a funky music. And it makes the lights go off. It's actually really fun to play with. We encourage you to play with it if you want. I know it's really hard to talk into these. But we do encourage you to try and muster up the energy. Because it does work. Can you tell me your name? I tell you what, we have some names here. If I call your name out, can you either talk to the radio or touch the green light? Can we try that? Okay, well thank you for answering that. You can give it a try. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I have the name Elijah, or Ahijah. Said no? No, said no. Dorothy? Sally? Yes. Did your name Sally, yes or no? Is Sally with us right now? <clears throat> Sally, how old are you? We just saw the light flash. Was that you? Sally, did you have a brother named Aaron? Sally, have you been pulling on... Our friend Aaron's leg, thinking that's your brother Aaron. Are you attached to our friend Aaron because he has the same name as your brother Aaron? Do you know who pulled on our friend Aaron's leg? Was someone trying to get his attention? What was that? Okay. Do you have a message for Aaron? Was there something you were trying to tell him? What were you trying to tell our friend Aaron? Myra, Clarissa, if either one of you are with us, I have a device in front of me that if you come close, the lights will change colors and more of them will light up. It's pretty cool. 
All you have to do is get close to the device and it'll light up. Yep, all you have to do is get close to the device and it'll light up with all different color lights. You just have to reach out with your energy. We have some equipment in here that you can use. You can draw the energy from our cameras, from our phones. You can use that to speak to me through the radio or to use the device in front of me to light it up. Have you lived in this house a long time? It's a beautiful house. Thank you for allowing us to come in here and spend some time with you. You're a wonderful hostess or host. Host. Okay. Do you like sharing your house with other people? Do you enjoy sharing the house with other people? Okay. Can you do me a favor and can you light up the device in front of me with the green light on it? You just have to reach out to it and it'll light up all different colors. And that'll tell me that you're here. It was going off earlier, so someone was playing with it, which was really great. Can you do it again? Well, I'd like to thank you for talking with me. I really do appreciate your time. And as I said, you are a wonderful host, so thank you for allowing me into your home. It is much appreciated. Yeah, Kev. Just so you know, there is a tremendous amount of orbs constantly flying around in that room, and all the other rooms are pretty static. I don't know if it's just dust kicked up because that room's active, but there's a lot of stuff flying around. Cool. Thank you. Bring the camera over here real quick. Mm -hmm. So we're using the Necrophonic app. And just so you know, everything's in airplane mode. There's no Wi-Fi, there's no signal to it, no manipulation whatsoever, just the app itself. And then there is a cord to the headphones that she's also going to be blindfolded with. She's going to be listening to this, we'll be listening to the speaker. Yeah, my screen froze. Aaron's screen froze. Get him. And 9 minutes and 25 seconds. Did you say the camera froze? Yeah, did I lose memory? You want to go down and take a chat? Quick chat with them? Yeah, I'll just like here if you need. Right. Yeah, do that. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to sit over here away from her. Excuse me. So we got that camera on me, you got that camera on her. Mm -hmm. My friend Carolyn is sitting with headphones on. She's listening to an app that you can talk to, or a device you can talk to. Can anybody go over and say hi to her? Can anybody give her a touch? Can you touch her on the knee? Okay. I'm going to step out of the room real quick. John. What? I'm not getting any feed from this, so. You're not getting any sound from the necro? Nothing. It was. It turned off. That's fine. Okay, cool. Okay, the necrophonic needs to be reset. Okay. I 
heard something. listening to the necrophonics app. I asked something to touch her knee. She had a reaction to her knee. I'm now down here because I'm going to ask a question down here to see if I get a response upstairs. Okay. Yeah. If, if Samuel, Anna, or Sally is here and can hear me, please say Carolyn's name now. One of you or a spirit in here can hear me. Can you please touch Carolyn Your on the shoulder? He's dead. Aaron. How do you know Aaron? He. Dead. Yes. Dead. Is it bad? Oh dear. Girl. Murdered. Yes. Someone would. That's it. Girl. Death. Death. Yep. We die. Smoke burning about she killed. One moment. This. You. Wait. Done. You done? Are you sure Are you, you coming? Done? I'm back. Are you okay with me being back? Tell me your name. What's my name? Hi, that's what I'm trying to find out. Can you tell me your name? Lee from Fitchburg. Hi, Lee. Lee, Lee Sean. That's my name. I'm Sean. Do you okay. know me? Do you know me through these devices? Hey. Hey. How many spirits are coming through this right now? Eight. Wow. Well, we welcome light-hearted entities, evil and malicious spirits, and not welcome to this conversation. Do you understand that? Duh. Can any make noise. Ask him. Can you make noise for us? Can you verify that with any type of knocking? Make noise, it's easy. The okay. light. Yeah, there's plenty of lights. If you can touch the light and make it go off, that would be fantastic. Where? There's some on the table in front of Carolyn. Lee. Leroy. Leroy who? What's your last name? 
It's Aaron. Okay. Can you tell me what I'll the I'll say. Can you tell me who the gentleman is standing up? Can you tell me his name? Are you entities from this house? Or Sean. Yes, that's me. Do you have a message for me? Go. Go where? Down. Go down? Up. I can't go any higher. Do you want me to go downstairs? One moment. One moment for My mistake. Okay. The mistakes are okay. We're all human. Can you tell me what you're doing here? No. Are you just here to hang out and try this? Yes. Hey. Do you know the name of the person who's doing the talking for you? No. That's my friend Karen. I'm sit. I am sitting. Here. You know, I'm going to sit right here right now. Is that okay with you? The reason being is because that way she can't hear what I'm asking. She hears what you're saying. Sean. Yes. Aaron. Yes. Keep going. Who else is in this room? Her hydra. Really? And he's... Can Ahijah come forth and speak with us right now? Looking. Looking for what? Ahijah. You're looking for Ahijah? Help out. Oh, you're looking to help. Are you a spirit guy? I'll look. Smile. Have you done this with me before? Of course. Well, I thank you for coming back to, to talk with us. I appreciate the help. Can we speak with Sally? Sally, are you here right now? Leave. Who needs to leave? To leave, please. You. Why do we need to leave? The room. Why would you like us to leave the room? Would you like for us to stop? No. Then why would you like me to leave the room? Trapped. Who's Dave. Trapped? David's trapped? Yes. Why are you trapped? Where are you? Are you trapped in here? Lord. You trapped in the Lord? Yeah. Okay. I really appreciate all of you who came out to chat with us. But we're going to turn this off and take a break. I hope you understand that I and you're do. okay with that. What I need you to know is nobody is allowed to attach Thank to you. Carolyn, myself, yep. or either of the gentlemen on either side of me. Nobody's allowed to attach to the equipment or the house. Yep. Do you understand that, yes? We're going to take a break. We'll be back. I'll be. Okay. Thank you very much. So if there are any spirits in this room with us still, this little ball, it will stop lighting up in a moment. But then if you move it, it'll actually light up again. So I don't know if you'd like to have some fun and try it. You see that? I'm going to stop it. 
And my challenge to you is when that stops, I challenge you to make it go off. What do you think? Can you get that ball to move? That's my challenge for you. I think I'm gonna go and make that I got three move? more of those cat balls. That would be really cool. I'm gonna step out and I'm gonna go in and grab those other three cat balls and, and put them downstairs, probably in the, the living room, the kitchen, and and we'll we'll see where I go and, and see if any of those trigger. Um, and I'm not gonna tell them that. I'll be back in a moment. That was crazy though. You can hear it so much better with headphones. Oh, absolutely. And it was just like so much coming through. A lot of whispers uh, in Spanish, and I think it sounded like French. Well, yeah. yeah. That's not working. Well. I heard Kevin's name at one point that I I said out loud. Hmm. Oh. So do you guys want to reconvene and like go downstairs, take a, yeah. actually take a, a break for a few minutes? Break. Because for me, it's off this battery too. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it shouldn't stay on quite that long, but yeah, I mean, it's still rocking too. Yeah. I'm only like one and a half hands right now. You are. I can take something. I have an extra hand. The laser grid is that still on? I have it right there. Is it still on? No. You shut it down. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. Shoot and shut everything off. So that was from your end. I'm fine. I mean, it's pretty cool. I'm keeping uh, an eye out. There are some distinct orbs flying around, but it is there what it is. is. Too. Do you want to take the camera and replace the battery? Or is this one draining? draining? Yeah, this is the oh, dive. As soon as we finish, like, as we were okay. turning off the equipment, it turned off. One living room's going on. Make sure to close the door oh, so oh, it oh, turns oh. off. Hey. It's going down in the living room. Whoa. That's happening. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, that's been going on. Awesome. Okay. Alright, great. Aaron, what's oh, yeah. I was recording that behind your back. Yeah. This one's this one's dead. Um, if it's you want to, off. it's off, but you can turn it back on if you want to keep going. Sure. Nice one. Well. Just open things. the door. Uh-huh. It should turn itself back on. Okay. Is there a button behind right there? Okay, hold on. The top one, because this is the oddball, the top one is night vision. And then get that camera on there. That is on. Oh, you see the green light there, and then the core button is right there. Yeah, do you see mean, at least get up to the camera frame so you okay. can see? Um, we we stopped camera B. We're restarting it. This is an audio slate. Flashlight. So and Kevin's got one here, one there, and we got one on the stairs. The cat balls. Okay, cool. That one's going off. I just put the the K two oh, next to it. Aaron's been recording it. This is at least the third or fourth time. Yeah. I'm going to use the restroom real yep. quick. Um, and yeah, then I just peed outside. <laughs> I will go in. Okay. Help me get under. Is this going for I'll a set up the laser grade. Okay. And then you guys can sit out here. Okay. I'll have somebody in there with me. Yeah. You guys sit out here and okay. we'll try that. All right. Sound cool. good? Yeah, sounds good. Ah, what? You need to hit me with the back hand, didn't you? Yeah. With the new um, It's so funny because there's like nothing going on in there earlier. I know. It's the fifth time right there. Look at that. Yeah.
starting necro, going under. And if I want to say something, I will raise my hands, just so you know. Understood. I'm very quiet now. I can now hear it. Here? My name's Carolyn. What's your name? Trap. What's a trap? With what? Trap with what? Are you trapped in this house? Yes. Is there anything we can do to help you? Are you happy with the people that are living in this house right now? No. No? Why not? Brett. Brett? What about Brett? Come. Come. What? What about Brett? It's easy. What's easy? Did you follow someone into this house when they moved in? Yeah. Yeah? Are you attached to this person? Yep. Why are you attached to this person? That's him. That's him. Who? Why are you attached to this person that lives here? This is cool. Oh, I'm glad you're having a good time. We're having a good time too. We like talking to people. Are you listening? I am listening. And Sean is listening. I can hear him. He's saying, you know, letting me know what you're saying. Try hard. Okay. Are you trying hard to communicate with us? I know it can be hard. Yes. Yeah, well, we have a lot of uh, cameras and other devices that you can use to draw power from. The tablet that Sean has that you're speaking through, you can use that as well to collect the energy to be able to come through better. Dude. Wish me something. Did someone just touch my leg? I just felt my hand again. Oh my god. Did someone just touch Sean's hand or my leg? Is it? I was like, mm. like the same thing upstairs where I felt like something was like not hurting but just poking through my knee. Person. But it's like a weird like warmth that sends a tingle down my leg. It's, it's me. It's so weird. I think that's what it was. Ooh, I gave me like chills. Yeah, I keep getting an interesting sense, you know, like mold or... Really? Are you care of question? Yeah. And that's not normal for in here? Yeah, it's not normal. Huh. Hey, I'm going to ask you a question. So, so guys, do you know, your do name you know my name? name? No. You don't want to tell us your name? Um... Who's talking right now? What's your name? <clears throat> Billy? Billy? Billy, did you live in this house? Oh my. Did you live here, Billy? <clears throat> curse. What's cursed? Curse you. Oh, no, see, we don't play like that. That's not nice. Please do not be disrespectful. We're not being disrespectful to you. We have the utmost respect. And if there's anything here or anyone here that wishes to do us harm, you are not welcome. And I want to call upon our spirit guides, the entities that are good and lighthearted that will help us to communicate with other entities as well. Who's talking right now? What's your name? Friendly. Brenda? Hi, Brenda. It's nice to meet you. My name is Carolyn. My friend Sean is Carolyn. talking. Yep, my friend Sh Sean is talking through a device. This? Yes, that. 
the tablet. Is there anything you'd like to say to us or tell us? Can you check the tablet? It's gone completely silent. Uh, the tablet tablet screen is gone. You're clear. It, right. Carolyn, it shut itself off. Really? Yeah. Yep. It's never done that. It will, did once before. I will let you know. Huh. Um, you twitched really quick, and all of a sudden the flashlight flipped on. You've already been under for a while. You want yeah. to take a break? <clears throat> yeah. yeah. You just yeah, we're just like getting ready to come and get you. I need some water. No, no. Me too. All right. Let's see something. <clears throat> What's that, Kevin? Do you want me to um, bring in the SLS? We're actually going to take a break for a moment. Okay. Well, that broke it. Yep. Oh, reset. What, what just clicked? It might have because I keyed the mic without really thinking of that microphone. Is yeah. that the red part? Yeah, I think it's because I forgot that the microphone was in here and I keyed the walkie. And yeah, that REM pod went. You're walking when you eat that, it triggers the red part? Yeah. Good to know. Yeah. I'm going to test that though. I'm going to do it again. You ready? Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Three, two, one, key. You did, everything went off. Every time. You can uh, do that yeah. one more time, but look more closely at the uh, millimeter. See if that's like anything. All right. You got your eyes on that? Yep. So even the Paralamp, the the K2, and the Necropod. Three, two, one, key. Yep. So we just hit a thousand for a half second. Because all I do is click and let go. And yeah, even the millimeter like spiked really high. So it makes you question whether or not, you know, when you see stuff on TV, if they're doing that remotely. Yeah, I know. But, uh, yeah, we're coming out to get some water. I'm going to leave all this stuff on right here. Um, plus your microphone to the cab. So that if anything does change, we'll be able to see it. Can you see the millimeter okay? I can see it, but I can't see what it's reading. That's why we have to go from on it. Oh, it does have it. Okay. That, yeah, that way there, if anything does go off. Um, I'm also going to leave the walkie right here. Just for the simple fact of by itself, there's nothing going on. But if anything keys it without us in the room, you never know. So far, it's been rather interesting. Yes, we got a lot of feedback. The wire is right outside the door on the porch. Okay, thank you. Aaron, is your bedroom door glassy? My best friend. Uh, it's not. Why is it? It's being open. Well, I wanted to keep it loose in case something was able to move it. Same thing with um, the tattoo room. It looks like you have a door wedge under it. I don't know if you can yes. pull that yes. and that can uh, straight below. It'll be made. So if something can move it, it'll be able to move. Yeah, my door reflows. It's not, it's not latching. I'm gonna unlatch my door because my door doesn't latch on. Okay, so the capture room, the door is settled to a spot. So if it moves, you know, it might, it might be able to catch it. Dude, it, it's pretty, pretty sturdy. Yeah, it's good. I everybody say still. Kevin, is it one or two? Kevin? I can barely hear you. What's up? Let me steal this real quick. Yeah. One ball or two? Uh, it was the one closer to, looks like the K2. The first, just one ball. I'm wondering if the heat sh shook the house just enough when it kicked on. Can you let me know when it clears? It's not on now. It, it just kicks on for a few seconds and, and stops. Maybe uh, 
down, the channel coming down the stairs might have vibrated something, I don't know. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. You good? For a minute? If there's something here that shook the, the cat ball and made the lights go off, can you do that again for me? They're really fun. And if you give it a little tap, it turns its lights on. Somebody was playing with one earlier. Could you turn it on again? here in the hallway, I keyed it to say something and I stopped because it was going off, but I'm standing in the exact same spot and I haven't moved and it's not going off as I key now. my keys, so it's very sporadic. Sometimes it's taken and sometimes it's not. Right now it almost seems like it's, it's activating when you release the key. Yeah, I noticed that too. I'm now in the tattoo room to be away from it a little bit more. test. That thing's still going on. We didn't have this much trouble with it before. Now I'm on the other side of the tattoo room, furthest from it that I could be. Well, it didn't trigger that time when you released it, so I don't know what's going on with that. I'm going to try doing the key test again. Obviously triggered again. That one triggered again. Yeah. So, I'm going to leave one radio, I'm going to leave all the gadgets here. If you guys want, if any spirit wants, I'm going to take a, we're all going to take a break. You are going to have this room to yourself to do whatever you want to try and see how this stuff works. You're welcome to play and try and move things, set things off. We're gonna give you some space to try this, okay? We'll be back. Can we put this on the one? Or? Uh, yeah, put it on the other one. All right, that's from the table when we put that down. Mm -hmm. Um, 
the SLS is on you, you can kind of set that off to the side. So there's two parts there, so pick up the camera part first. Uh, did you say you're not coming in? Oh no, I'll come in, but I don't need oh. to sit down right now. Uh, okay. I'm old. <laughs> I still have some use in my joints left. I did. No door got open. Right in, coming downstairs. Hey guys. What the fuck is that? It's the thing. Red pod? Yeah. Did you say something? It's every time it's mic. Yeah. So Sam and I were in the van and we heard something come through the audio. It sounded like either a screech or a little child. And then uh, every time you key the mic, the REM pod's still going off. Okay, that's interesting. Um, I know yeah, when you were under, there was a couple of voices I heard, but I don't know if it was Sam talking or if it was just a random voice somewhere, but I, I did hear it a couple of times. I think I noted it too. It's going off. That is 100%. And I think that REM pod might be going off on its own because it was on while you were talking. It came on and then shut itself back off. Okay, I'm going to stop uh, keying the mic and we'll just monitor for that. I thought of a fun game we can play. If I if we ask you a question, if it's a yes, light up the green one as much as you can. If it's a no, make anything else on the table go off. Do you understand that? It's not hard. You just gotta go here. There's a lot of different things on here. If you touch the flashlight, which is that standing tube, you can turn the light on that. The circular things, if you touch the antennas, oh, and yep, yeah, you can change that. Is there a particular reason why you're using that one? Is it the easiest one? Do you just like the lights? I just feel like a cold breeze through my hand. Mm -hmm. I can feel it on my legs now. What's up? I can feel it like going across my legs on my knees. But it was coming from this way, right? Yeah, it just like went right across. Was that you going from the center of the room? To the other side of the table? Can you light up that circle thing with the antenna? It has a green light on it. Do you see it? You seem to like green lights. Can you make that green light go off? Are you still here? If you're still here, can you light up any of the devices? Anything on the table? I'm starting to think that breeze was it moving. Yeah, probably. If you were here, we appreciate your efforts. We thank you for that. It's about time to get the lights on and start wrapping up. Yeah, about that time. Ghosts are like, ah, I'm going to bed. Yeah, I already feel like you guys have me up all night. Yeah, yeah. They have a party to go to, who knows? Right? Uh, it's Friday. I mean. 
All right. So what did Sam think of his first? I thought it was awesome, honestly, okay. and freaking amazing. Very cool. And actually really, like, just very it's informational, I guess. Mm -hmm. Like, I definitely learned a lot more than I knew before. Mm -hmm. And getting to see everything happen in action was so much different than ever watching, like, a show or mm -hmm. anything remarkable, like, close to it. Definitely got some decent evidence on there though.